Up until now, we've been previewing all of our content on the desktop, but you can also preview on your device. Previewing your content on the device is critical to the design process. You can see how the colors are going to appear and how the text is going to read. One of the things in the list of downloads was the Adobe Content Viewer app. So if you own either an iPad or an Android device, you can actually use this to preview your content before it's published or to share it with other people. The app is quite simple to use. And when you download it, there's instructions on how to use the app from Adobe. Once you install it, what you'll see is a list of all of your folios. So all of the ones that you've created or you have shared. If something is new, you'll get a message saying that one of them needs to be updated. And it'll give you the title. So you'll notice here in this view, I've got thumbnails of my covers. Uh, you can either view them as thumbnails or full size. You'll have a table of contents that you can access. And there's a scrubber at the bottom that will allow you to go back and forth. And this is another view that gives you thumbnails and, and full pages. So that page that we did that was a full scroll, you can see in comparison in the thumbnail views is a longer page. So let's go back to InDesign. Okay, so here's my folio builder. I need to make sure that I'm viewing my folios and not my articles. And I can select the one that I want to preview. And down at the bottom of my folio builder panel, there is now an arrow next to preview. And when I click it, uh, it will give me a pop-up menu. And I now have the choice of previewing on desktop or on my iPad. This is because I've connected the device. So I've used the cable and I've connected it into my computer. And I need to launch the Adobe Content Viewer app and have it open in the foreground. So in other words, when I look at my iPad, I should be seeing the Content Viewer. And when I do that, then when I click this, it will actually bring up my publication on my device. And of course, you can't see my screen, but um, you'll get the idea. And I highly recommend that you do this. Um, now, for the purposes of our course, because I wanted you to see the preview, I've been doing it on desktop, but really on device, as I said, I can't stress how important it is to see your content this way. It will allow you to make many, many decisions um, as you're designing or at certain points in your design process uh, that are critical to delivering quality content to your user.